Yeah, what up everybody? It's your boy SB the Don. Back at it again. I uh, wanted to show you all a new pickup I just got. They're the uh, Air Max 98 Chinese New Year. For those that don't know, uh, they were uh, limited release only in China. And I grabbed a pair. And uh, fuck it, let's check them out. So they come in this in this box right here, Air Max 98. Um it's, I believe it's a special box. Um with a little bit of branding there. Turn the box around. It's got you know some details on the box. It's a really nice box. Usually the 98s come in those, you know, regular Nike boxes, but this was a nice little touch. It's kind of like a teal, teal color. Um, and then we're going to get into the shoes real quick. They do come with this logo that is also, let me, let me focus that in for y'all. With this logo on the top uh, inside portion of the box that's on the bottom of the 9.8s as well. So that's pretty cool. It looks like, I, I, I can't really, to maybe like some hands praying. Pretty cool. Uh, it does come with special paper. The paper is the pattern that you've seen on the other uh, Chinese New Year releases. And here we go. Yeah, they're, they're interesting. We'll say that. Um, since they were a China-only release, I decided to trust Kicks Crew. And there's been lots of videos... With Kickscrew, are they legit? Are they not? Uh, the Kickscrew goes to like SneakerCon, Hong Kong. Um, I think that their shoes are legit. People have done comparisons on YouTube for certain shoes, but because these were China only release, I decided to cop off Kickscrew. Seeing as they are in Hong Kong, they would have the access to it. It would just make more sense like that. But, uh, yeah, let's get into it. There's all sorts of different materials on this shoe. The shoe is very crazy. So, um, I'm going to set it down real quick. This this portion right here is kind of like a dragon type of skin. It's supposed to feel kind of like some scales, like reptile skin. Very cool. Um, the golden portion up top is actually pony hair. Uh, like if you bought the animal pack. Um, the, the Atmos animal pack, it's, it's that same type of pony hair as well. Um, the portion above that has that Tianjin print, um, that came out on those, uh, China only phone posits not too long ago, probably a couple years back. Um, it's got the red details. They're really nice. Let me take out the other shoes so y'all can see both. Uh, yeah, it's got the red detailing here. It's kind of like a patent leather. This is like a patent leather as well. This is all patent here. Uh, the tongue, I don't know. Uh, the tongue is pretty cool. It looks like, uh, kind of like a sky print. Um, that's mainly how I would describe it. Um, as I mentioned on the bottom, is that same logo that's on the inside of the box. Looks like the hands praying or a couple of hands put together. Very cool. Black bottom so you can wear them and they still look fresh. Don't have to worry about cleaning them up all the time like with the clear sole. Um, the insole. Let's see if I can get that for y'all. It has a special insole as well. Um, it's the same logo. That appears on the box um, up here. That same. Let me see if I can focus that for y'all. That same logo is on each insole on each respective shoe. Um, overall, these things are fire. Um, I thoroughly like them. I will be doing it on foot soon, but I just wanted to share these with y'all because these are something that. I feel like should have been released in the U.S., but they didn't for some reason. Even though they released like every other Chinese New Year shoe except for this one, 
At least that's how I feel. I'm not sure. But I don't know. I like these a lot. The 9.8s are super comfortable. Um, overall, yeah, it's a really nice shoe. Um, trying to see if I'm missing any details. They got the Air Max logo on the tongue. Um, and as far as just to answer questions about Kicks Crew, um, from what y'all can tell you, y'all can look at the air bubbles too. I mean, I thoroughly check these and they look legit. Um, I've purchased from Kicks Crew before different stuff like back in the day too, like KD4 scoring titles and um, just a bunch of different stuff from Kicks Crew. And it's been all legit. Um, I paid the extra for the EMS shipping and these literally got here from China in like three days. So super legit. Um, overall, very satisfied with the shoe. Um, putting some more, just look at the details on top. Very cool with the little change in print. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, I'm sorry. The multicolored shoelaces. They got little uh, metallic, they got metallic tips at the, or aglets at the end of the shoelaces here. So that's pretty cool. So overall, great touch. This is supposed to be kind of like a what the shoe, even though both shoes aren't different. It's combining a bunch of elements into one shoe. So I definitely dig them. Uh, let me know what y'all think in the comments. Subscribe, do what you got to do. Um, yeah, it's your boy Speed the Dunn. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, let me know what y'all think. If y'all need more info or need, need to know where to get a pair, I might be able to link y'all up. Um, but aside from that, hey, peace out. Thanks for watching.